Hi, today I'm back with another tutorial and I'm going to show you how to draw a simple manga iris. So what I'm going to do is that I'll choose the circle tool and draw a perfect shape. An iris shape, sorry. So that's pretty much that. So that's perfect. And yeah, notice that I already took a great blue color. And after that, you want to draw a pupil and make sure that pupil is because normally a pupil is black but some people like to change the color I don't know why but maybe to make their character special I don't know so make sure it's in the middle so at the moment I'm trying to find the perfect middle so and that's not that perfect okay I'll try again and I think that's good. So that's pretty much that. After you select this, the lines, and you put it perfectly straight. That's it. It's straight. And to the other side too. Okay. So after that, you need to modify the shape of those lines and put it more rounder. Um, it's round render and you want it pretty much not like this but like that okay so after you did that you add the black color here yeah I don't know why you did that so if it just does that to you just make sure that your lines are perf perfectly in the middle circle and whatever I don't know why, okay, it was this one, so I had the black color, and you'll see that this is special, but after, like, we add mod more details, and it will be more perfect. So after, you, you want to go to preferences and reduce the size of these lines to draw the sh shades, so we'll simply delimit this this with the, those lines so that's what I'm doing that will be not long but you see that yeah, you need to train <laughs> no that's not that hard at all but yeah, at the mouse it's not the greatest thing that you want to do the shade when you do the shades so we'll yeah so I did that so you don't you, you need to make more layers than that so in that tutorial I'll make three but if you want you can make five you can make six I think but three is perfect because you will be able to see the different you see the difference between this big thing and the rest so I'll zoom in so we see that the lines are all stick all together okay and I think that's pretty much that okay mm, yeah so I got it and I feel you did that you it's not that perfect but in your old draw you you won't see that this is not perfectly like this part so you Sorry, I've uh, throw difficulties or whatever. I don't know what it really is. So, um, yeah. So you want to choose another color, but in the black shade. So you go to the color, the color thing, and you change it. You put it more lighter, lighter. Sorry. Okay. So that's pretty much that. I think. Yeah, so you see that it's a bit lighter. So after you do another layer, I'll try. I'll try to draw it more more fast. So see, we're going to try to make it perfectly. Um, yeah, okay, this is good, this is good, and 
this is not good but you know okay I think we'd be okay with this okay so I'll select this I again I'm going to the to make some nuances okay, so it's more lighter not too much but try to make it you know that we can see the difference even if it's like at like this or like that okay so we did the second thing so what we're going to do is we'll draw again I can, yeah, I'll draw the third one. And this one will be, I, I don't know. Let's see. Normally what I do is that I take my time to do it, but in case of doing this tutorial, we need to we need learn fast. I. People don't people don't like slow people, so that's why I'm trying trying to do the more the best I can, but faster. And notice that I'm not using any graphic tablet, so that's why it's pretty hard. Not that hard, but you know it's better with a graphic tablet. So I'll just because with the gra graphic tablet you just need to use the paint line the, or the pencil okay so I did the three layers and okay so that's perfect I'm going to the to a, another the last nuances and yeah so after this you re remove the lines okay I remove the first second the third <laughs> I mess up yeah okay the third controls is your best friend in that case so after this you try to add the highlights or the reflex whatever it is so you just simply use a circle tool and yeah that's pretty much that okay so you add the circle tool and if you want you can add one ear too no that's not that beautiful so I add lines white lines too if you want I like those white lines um, and try to sh reshape it oh wait if, me I don't like this like that so I'll just I, if you want you can change the color again and make it look the way you like so that was that for that tutorial so i hope you enjoy and if you have question comment or suggestion or if you wanna like show me a technique i don't know why i'm not i'm not professional but i try to make the best i can i'll try to make you learn something from that so that will be that for that video